right, here we go. Beautiful pictures, at least from the inside and the comfort of the warmth of your home because it's cold out there. Look at the sunshine, blue skies, Raleigh, 43 degrees, sunny in Wake Forest, 42, 44 in Apex, and Chapel Hill, 42 degrees. So it's a little chilly out there. Check out the temperature change from yesterday. I know yesterday was cloudy and, and rainy, but it was warm. It was in the lower 60s. We're a good 20 degrees colder in the Triangle, 17 degrees colder in Fayetteville. So it is a slap to the system when you step outside today compared to the warmth that we had the last couple of days, at least relatively so. But right now, boy, 43 in the Triangle, but only still 39 in Roxboro, 42 in Siler City, 43 in Roanoke Rapids, 44 in Wilson, 47 in Goldsboro, and 47 in Fayetteville. The radar sweeping, and it's not going to find anything. We're going to stay high and dry today with the clear skies for the most part. So I've just got sunny skies. So the rays, this is giving it away, but the rays of sunshine... Um, yeah, we can't get any brighter than it is out there right now, right? Here's what you can expect for the next uh, several days. Colder and dry through Saturday. Obviously, we're experiencing the colder air today, but it's going to stay below normal or so through Saturday, at or below normal. A couple rain showers, maybe late Sunday into Monday. That's about our only precipitation chance right through Christmas. As a matter of fact, for Santa Claus, it's going to be dry and milder. I mean, I'm talking back to those low 60s on Christmas Day. But your hour by hour this afternoon, sunny skies, and then once the sun goes down at 504, clear skies. Winds, not too bad. A little breeze at times out of the dry direction out of the west at 9 or so. That's the reading at 4 o'clock. We'll be in the upper 40s, and then we'll drop quickly. Look at that at midnight down to 30. So you know it's going to get cold tonight. Prepare for this. By tomorrow morning, these are your low temperatures. 24 in the Triangle, 28 in Fayetteville, 25 in Rocky Mount. Close to the teens, maybe, along the Virginia border areas and maybe some low-lying areas, so I'll have to keep an eye on that. But the future cast keeps it nice and sunny today. We go into tonight. This is a dry front that comes through, and that's why you'll see on the forecast tomorrow is going to be colder than today. It'll be the coldest day of the week as this high will take over. But with it floating on by, we're going to keep the sky sunny for Thursday. And then as we head into Friday, the high will back off a little bit, and we'll get close to 50 again, but it will stay mostly sunny. On Friday, there's 5 o'clock, not really nary a cloud to be found. And then as we head into Saturday, it'll turn partly sunny, and a little bit of this precipitation getting organized might come our way late Sunday and into Monday. It's a little southern system that'll be flirting with us. But for this afternoon, sunny and chilled, like your orange juice, northwest winds 5 to 10, 49 in Sanford and Lillington, maybe 50 in Fayetteville and Fort Bragg. We'll see 49 in uh, Wilson, 49 in Smithfield, 48 Raleigh and Cary, 48 Durham, 46 in Roxboro. So here you go with the forecast. 48 in sunshine today, 24 tonight, cold day tomorrow, 42, and back into the mid-20s with clear skies tomorrow night. Mostly sunny on Friday, 52. Clouds and sun on Saturday, but it should stay dry, 48 degrees. And then on Sunday, for the first day of ha Hanukkah, a few more clouds and maybe a shower late in the day, but only a 20% chance. Our best chance is just a couple showers on Monday. We'll see 56. And then as we head into Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, I'm talking about warmer temperatures, 61 to 60 degrees, and it will be dry. And then as uh, the rest of the post-Christmas post rush gets going, we'll be in the 50s, and it will stay dry. So the one thing you know that's not happening is a white Christmas for Santa Claus right here.